band who decided it would be a good idea to break into an R abandoned RAF village and have a picnic in a tree. <laughs> How foolish they were. But you see, everything that they touched was poison and everything that they ate was death. I'm really quite hungry for some death. <laughs> everything that they breathed was not air but rot and filth. Yeah, we, we, don't, we don't deal with concepts or ideas. Uh, we're just a carnal band and what happens, happens because uh, we wanted to fuck or we wanted to eat. Alright, how you doing governor? World War 3 was fucking horrible though, wasn't it? Yeah, World War 3 was... All them deaths and... I just, I just think the world became a horrible place it's after I'm really World in the mood for it, to tell you the truth. But it's alright, it's post apocalypse now. Yeah, it's cool. I think, <laughs> I think we're doing alright. Yeah. I think if we, if we teach these lessons to the, the youth of today, they might find the, a place too in this, this fragile and scary world. He says this place here, it got quite sick. And there's a little bit of a, what's a pandemic contained within a village called? Epidemic. Now it's a big one, isn't smaller it? Smaller demic. What's smaller than a pandemic? Tiny demic. Tiny demic, there's a tiny demic here and had to move them all away. And then a few years later, uh, these pesky kids came up and uh, they got some of the disease, they kind of like started spreading it. Like, military started getting really heavy handed, there's a mass revolt against the government. And then uh, there's all kinds of shit happened. So, you guys from that side? Yeah. Be, so, the eventually got 70 dodgy We're going to the air house. <laughs> there's air house that way. Uh, what about that one? That one looks. Very Got your milk, <laughs> Dennis? <laughs> you rang the doorbell. Yeah, yeah, both of them. Ben Rose. Resting between two mountains. Mountain. Yeah. Smell of death in there. Why did you have to ask about the apocalypse? I mean, right. shall we? <laughs> yeah. We're we're more or less a, a faceless consortium, pumping out sound waves to manipulate your mind. You grand. <laughs> And your dad. Do you actually look faceless? It's quite good actually. No. Uh, probably only as good as one of my Yeah, it's not So this is where the apocalypse started? Yeah, it all ended. I can't remember now, it's a long time ago. If you read this and you should not be in here, <laughs> taking things without consent constitutes stealing. Heaven penalties will ensure. <laughs> to explore as well. It's bringing back so many memories. There's a really nice looking really speaker good. here. Good thing. I reckon that speaker might be a really good steel. It'll still work. Oh, I'm great. Sure. Pull it off then. It's a really nice toilet there. I think I'm actually it's really nice yeah. steel. I can see myself living yeah, here. Yeah, I can see myself living in here. It'd be quite scary if we saw ourselves dying in here. Yeah, that would be worse. Are you in a rush, Jimmy? It's a stoat. I don't know what it is. A squirrel. It looks pretty happy. I think it died. Look at that fucking drinks cabinet. That's beautiful. That's lovely. That's really nice. That's pantry. Where they drink blood from. Okay. Really? Yeah. I'm oh, sorry for that. That poor London girl. She's oh still... yeah, Jocelyn. I forgot about Jocelyn. Sorry Jocelyn. If you're watching. Sorry. Uh... Well, we're the last people to leave the village. 
and uh, we stood our ground for longer than most but I think it is it's truly time to move out there's nothing here but bad odours and melon cakes You know what we could do? We could send our album back to 2007, 2008, yeah. and, uh, yeah. and teach them like, 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 like May, May 2008 maybe. Maybe, yeah, if, maybe June, yeah. or July. If August. we make the music horrible enough on our first debut album, we could send it back to 2008, warn them about the apocalypse, and perhaps our post-apocalyptic time jazz will have an effect have on their minds. I've got some carrot cake Is that actually. Apocalyptic. <laughs> 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 Oi lads. <laughs> let's let's fucking have some hooky pooky, eh? So what was that thing you heard about her liking then? I heard he had such nice eyes that he thought he lacked physical presence. So he went on to eBay and bought some murderous eyes. Really? What was that about Errol Alkin then? That? Yeah. What about his teeth? Oh yeah, what about his teeth? Actually, pig's teeth. Oh, I heard he got t pig's teeth installed as well. Yeah. The new pig's teeth 5000. Yeah, that's right. Hey, look at that fucking oh, house! Fucking look at that. I'd like to break into an house like that. I've always wanted to. I, I love breaking, breaking into, into things. Houses. No Should ladders. Let's fucking do it. Disguises, lads! Disguises! What are you looking at? There's some bird cooking in the kitchen! Hey! I'm getting too good for that. Fwoah! 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 Hey, disguises, lads! Oh, disguises! <laughs> Alright, then. I better give you a leg up, Potter. I better give you a leg up. I've got a bad knee. Oh, that's the one. You can get through that. Come on, then. Come on, then. Come on! Come on! Oh, oh, fuck it out. Get that. Fucking cup of tea. Is there any tea in there? Fucking cup of tea. I'll put it in the car then. <laughs> we don't have a car. Well, I'll put it on the bike then. Oh, fuck, I've got the bike. I'll be the chicken. Should we nick this? I like this. Is that so, solid gold? Is that your smile, Faley? Whoa, it is a ceramic smile. I'm having that. I'll just insert it into your face. Okay then, let's have a look what, what is in this house what hey, we've just broken have into. Have a look at this fucking shit hole. <laughs> <laughs> some fucking hairy catacombs from Ikea. Hello, we've got some records, lads. Shit. <laughs> fucking gash. Wank. Don't even know what it is, don't want to know. Oh, what's that? Mastercraft. What, m m Mr. Craft. Oh, last Mr. year's news. Mr. O. Mr. Croft. Oh, I don't mind that, it's just a load of invasion plans. What have you found in here, Ross? Oh, in studio. What's this? LLP, LFO, CLK. What's this? Eh? Parties. Let's break out of here. <laughs> I think that's why we chose to live in a house so far away from the world. <laughs> like being suspended so high up in the air, you get you get a lot of time to think, but you never think about anything else other than the stuff around you, which is air, clouds, a few planes now and again. 
few birds, get a bit of cellophane, you get crisp packets, you get kites, balloons. And these are the things that shape us, not, not music in any particular way. Apart from our own music, our Ross's alarm clock. Yeah. The sound of a porcelain doll being eaten by an alligator. Is that like, inbreeding? Hello, my name's Ross, and I'm from Your Dreams. <laughs> we're from Lake of the Pier, and we're going to show you around our house. Our coal shed. Come on in. See our coal shed. So, as you can see, we've been busy chopping. Here's our axe and our saw. We've run out of coal, though, which is a bit of a problem. We need to get some more. But we filmed a track in here the other day, actually. Recorded it in here, and it has quite a nice sound, doesn't it, Paley? It's, it's got a really good sound. Really good sound. One thing. This is the greatest room in the house. It's not, it's, it's just a toilet outside. I always want to go around. Here's our kitchen. We haven't really cleaned up since last night. Ignore the mess. Our hallway. But let's go upstairs. Oi! What's all that racket? You, where's Bailey? Bailey! 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 I can't even cough and my ears bleeding for you being so loud. <laughs> what do you want? Have you got that, um... Here's our drum kit, second drum kit on the landing. But here's our other magic Why? Hands. Why? This is our studio. Why? Have a look around. Funny thing is, this is actually the cleanest room. Cleanest room in the house? Yeah. <laughs> Why is that? Because I clean it every day. <laughs> yeah, but this has always been the messiest room in the house, and today it's the cleanest. Because I clean it every night, and we haven't done anything in here yet. That's good. I think we're going to turn it into a lunar module, or at least that was the plan. Do you know why I've got a hammer in the studio? Because I don't like cameramen. What's that? Is that you leaving? I thought so. Just go Come on. It's You want a taste of the hammer? God, fucking rock heads. Great music. I'm fucking tapped. This is a. Uh, this is the bombshell. <laughs> this is Potter's crack den. Hey, take a look at this though. What's the socks? You see that? I can't, I'm blind. It's a lovely light though. It's lights from a dead man's house. <laughs> <laughs> I could have put that phrase out a bit better. He got sure. it for his 21st birthday, didn't he? Yeah, there was a there was a lovely house next to one of our friends' houses and um the guy died and so, so they we bought took it his and house. we nicked Lump. his light. <laughs> Sorry. Oh they can't show him that, that's the mystery room. Here we have a vocal booth. Oh right next to the studio. You can piss so and sing, sing at the same time. I mean, a lot of people lot. like singing in the shower, but <laughs> we thought, let's do it. Let's, let's knock it up one more level. Let's, uh, let's piss and sing. This is where we bathe in the, <laughs> the bath. <laughs> Here's Sam's room. It's it's the two flat. cheap guitars in the corner that we use, a cello and a, a new Casio keyboard that we yeah. got. No, we didn't. Our mate stole it for us. Yeah, we stole it for us. Cheers, Benjamin. Sorry, we're I'm not to, I've to standard got two women on here. <laughs> <laughs> two ladies just waiting. The they, they came with the house, like, I've not kicked them out yet, so it's alright. It is pretty pimping it compared to the rest of the house, isn't it? <laughs> definitely the pimping bedroom, I would say. <laughs> definitely, definitely. Surprisingly cheap as well. Not the women, the. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Should have said that, should I? <laughs> um, what else have we got? We've got the the room of art, or the art room, or the gallery, or whatever you call it. <laughs> yeah, it's. Uh, I think we're just going to fill this full of uh, random art things. I think it'd be great. Here's Potter in our double garage. Here's my bedroom.
You just tidy all the porn? Yeah. Okay. Stop. Here's my drinks cabinet. Which actually lacks any drinks at the minute. Apart from a nice bottle of champagne, which I'm saving. So we keep, keep all our money in a, a vault behind this, this painting <laughs> here. If any of you out there are opportunists. <laughs> <laughs> Go get us, since we call yeah. it. But, uh, we're getting more furniture delivered here on Saturday. You need small paintings. Yeah, small paintings. It's got, oh, got yeah. two in there. Three in there. Need some more. <coughs> and a nice fire. Really sort of place actually. It is 20, 2018, wasn't it? Bailey just got married for the fourth time to his second daughter. To <laughs> every head. That is quite tricky, that was, because he really <laughs> fancied the second head, but the first one was always like the dominating one. And Bailey. Like, Leave that fucking second head alone. <laughs> what do you do about that, Bailey? I didn't do anything, I just left it to my lawyer. So anyway, the primordial soup was like bubbling, and then uh, we started a band. <laughs> um, and our sole desire as a band was to, uh, just to make music and to avoid all questions, not to speak about <laughs> the music, just let the music speak for itself. Why do you think of this one, Bailey? It looked really nice in your bedroom. It would, wouldn't it? <laughs> I think we could have a couple of them outside the house. Just I, haven't, front door. I haven't bought your mum something for Christmas yet either. I'm, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sure she'd love them this side. I do you like the colours. Cases. Yeah. Cases. I love cases. Yeah. 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 It's really cool, isn't it? Yeah, really I like nice. that a lot. <laughs> NATO. Protection. Safe sex. Jokers. Union <laughs> Squire. There's some nice knobs there. I might replace all the knobs on all my instruments with these little things. They're brilliant colours. Do you reckon you sell tank microphones or? Or air mics or anything. Probably. You won't ask that. Oh, look at the cameras. That, yeah. That's the most really <laughs> the top clock, but probably the greatest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. I like his expression. I know, look at him. <laughs> the time! I feel like a teacher in front of class. <laughs> They're all in here. <laughs> all the war stories. <laughs> Alright, guys. Oh, wow. I've always wanted a button. Wow. Pretty good to put your hand into. Can you see that camera? This that smell of I'm sure later the pier will be in here before you know it. Along with Broadway blockbusters. Have you seen this button that I found? Wow! That's for your mind. <laughs> that's for the landing. It does it? Yeah. Nice. It will work, yeah. What are you supposed to do? Just colour it in. Hiroshima. Oh my god, that's so fucking funny. That's really dark. <laughs> Colouring book, Hiroshima. Wow! It's through there. There's Colour a Nazi Germany one. <laughs> oh my god, where Colour is there in your own way. atomic bomb? Just name a wartime atrocity <laughs> and you can colour it in. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! So no funny. I don't think it's very funny. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. It's actually a pill. <laughs> That's actually a really good drawing. It's a really, really good drawing. drawing. Is that art? It's not very colour in though. It's for, it's for perverts to pinch ladies' bottoms and then to look on players. It's quite nice. That one's Fleet Street. <laughs> yeah. That's where all the um, old people's homes are. Oh, it's where it gets flooded. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Chuck him in the blender. <laughs> Quite like that idea. 
probably completely fucked the blender up. Mm. So, so basically, there's a tour based around the future album, which was done in the past. Obviously, we're talking about 2008 now, but it's 2018 here. Uh, consisted of Jimmy Savile on crack, on repeat for 16 days. And we were the support act. Epic show, really good. Nottingham had never seen anything like it. Crush! Since moving out, I've discovered smoothies are very important to a healthy diet. Uh, so, bought myself a smoothie maker. Now I'm going to take you through how to make one of the greatest smoothies I think I've ever made. Kiwi, single kiwi, contains ten times more vitamin C than an orange. So loads of kiwis. Loads and loads of kiwis. Uh, a lot of people peel oranges, I don't bother. That's your base. Now, I like mine not so thick, so I always need a bit of liquid. I recommend tomato ketchup, because it's good for you. A bit of spice. I recommend Havana Club. Some people don't like alcohol in their smoothies. I call these people weak. A little bit of ginger ale. In the meantime, you can be preparing your other. But firstly, plastic soldiers really don't need it. To it. You've got to be very careful when using plastic soldiers though, because too many cocks up the taste completely. I recommend three for a smoothie of this size. Now to give it a bit of body, one crumble wheat and eggs. Just need the last ingredient. I'm really thirsty, come on. I just need. There we go. Right, just run it round the edge. Yeah. I forgot really important chocolate fingers. More wine in there. Maybe. Yeah, maybe a little more. I think I still think. Can we try a bit of it? I've never tried it. When it's perfect, it should be more like a. Not exactly a sick consistency, but that sort of thick, gluttonous. It should have a growl to it. Yeah. Now when you throw it back up, it's better to throw it off back into the blender. See if you can put it back through again. Really still does the trick. Well, I'll finish it off. A little bit. There's a whole, there's a whole <coughs> rest of a glass here. <laughs> Too many toy soldiers. I even did the mixture. It's all a learning curve, though. It's all just a learning curve. Oh. Come on, Freddy. Oh. Oh, sit down. You're not a wild child, come on. Later, I'll be making lasagna. Oh, you're attached to a It'll be beautiful. Hello there. Later up here, here in the studio, um, we've uh, built this studio over the last two weeks. Um, we've acquired the equipment for the studio over the last five years, I'd say. 
Um, we've got quite a lot of shit. We've got um, loads of old synthesizers. They're kind of essential for making our sort of music, which um, is kind of faulty and breaks down a lot. Um, that's kind of the sound we're going for. Um, we've got this old organ, which is one of my favourite bits, but it's one of the later additions. It doesn't seem to make any noise at the moment. Oh, there we go. And um, around here, as you can see, this is the drum, what should we call it, the drum dungeon. Uh, it's not really much of a dungeon. The tin foil is for the reflections on the wall, as you probably know. Um, everybody knows that you put tin foil on the walls. Um, and we've got a bunch of old amps and stuff. Um, all we need now is a, a band to play them all. They're actually like just transistor radios, just pick up different frequencies. You can get some really good French radio on that one. And um, this is a plastic zebra. Um, what else? Oh yeah, soundproofing. That's made up of an old couch. And uh, we basically put that in because there's a horrible view out there of the countryside that we really didn't want, like spoiling our music. So. Uh, we were going to use Pro Tools, but um, we found it a bit too professional. So we've got uh, amateur tools. We just kind of regularly start again. Uh, I think we started again like three times on this album. Um, one of them was because um, I had a shave, and when I came back from having a shave, like um, all the the drums had been recorded at the wrong speed. Like they were fine before I shaved, and then I don't know because of the like less weight on my face or something and so we had to record all of that again and I'm not going to shave for the rest of this recording uh, session for the rest of the album. This is a copy of a copy of a copy but it's my best guitar. Um, very twangy. Uh, this one is also one of my least favourite. Um, that's for all the farmyard songs we do. Ah, now this is a bagpipe chanter. This is for people to practice before they move on to the bagpipes, as anybody in Scotland will know. Um, yeah. As I say, the keyboards are a very integral part of this studio, and. So are the walls. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> we thought we'd just smoke out the ears of you listening public. Have a few more bites of our cake. <laughs> kill it, you know. And kill it. <laughs> <laughs> How are we going to use any of them? <laughs> Mm. I need to sing it louder, that's the thing, but I need uh, to have this turned down. I think, I think we need to just make some opium and turn the lights off. When you put it quite loud as well, it's quite easy, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. But you can sing louder. If you do you want to? Do you want to go in there? Do you want to? Do you want us to trap you in the toilet? Mm. What? Do you want us to trap you in the toilet? No, I've got to do the whole track first. But if I do the vocals mm. now, then it, uh, uh, when I come to do the vocals on the second half, I like won't line up. Well. I'll save it. Okay. I'll, I know how to do it. Mm -hmm.
You're sucking the wrong, wrong end of a whistle, mate. I think I've got completely the wrong end of the stick. <laughs> Quite literally. I think as long as we're having fun and we're making something that's fresh and new and people are excited by it, I think we should stick with it. I really do, boys. I really do. I think there's a lot of value in that. I really do. Can't we hurt people as well? Yeah. Well, that's what albums are for, to put those tracks on that hurt people. When they're least expecting it, right? Yeah, alright. I'll have some cake. Right. It looks really nice. Yeah. Come on, everyone. Come on. Come, Come on, on, everyone. Let's talk about this. Let's talk it over. No, so, no, no. Freeze!